the spoilers of General Hospital hint that Harrison Chase will inform everyone about his wedding with Willow Tate. He will ask Willow to inform his best friend, Michael, about it. Chase says Finn to stop blaming himself for his condition, but Finn will keep on trying. As for Stella, she will start scolding Jordan for allowing her family to fall apart. The conversation then shifts to the issue of divorce and Jordan says that she is not the right person for Curtis. Over with Brooklyn Quartermain, she is aware that Willow loves Michael. Willow will be shocked that Brooklyn knows that she will try to give an explanation. BLQ acknowledges and tells Willow that she will be ready to help her with anything. After that, Brooklyn visits Chase in his hospital room and she embraces him as he expresses his dissatisfaction with the current situation. Moreover, Finn returns to his office and breaks down in front of Liz. He blames himself for Chase's condition, but she holds his hand and convinces him that he did nothing wrong. Similarly, Molly meets Alexis in the meeting room, who still has not visited a doctor regarding her osteoporosis, and they talk about their interest in the law. Alexis requests that she look up certain um, sentence records. Coming to Sean, he will get a visit from TJ and they talk about Curtis, and Sean says that his bail has been refused and that he will be unable to attend his graduation, and he advises him to reconsider seeing him in the future. But TJ is adamant that he will return. Furthermore, while Nina is spending time with Wiley, Carly along with Michael walks in and he takes Wiley to his room. Carly will then tell Nina that Michael is threatened by Jack to so let Nina reunite with Wiley. After that, Carly asks Michael to tell her everything, but he will change the subject and inquires Carly if she is willing to allow Jason to manage the company. Carly walks out and Willow enters shortly and immediately declares that she got engaged to Chase. Nina arrives at Jack's place and inquires about his intentions. He seems mysterious, but she expresses gratitude before clarifying that she owes him nothing. She also states that poor Charles will no longer be her hometown.